Alex Rodriguez, Out of the Ballpark, illustrated by Frank Morrison. Baseball, Alex lived for it. And it didn't get much better than this. His mom, brother, and sister were together in the stands for the first time all season. Today was the playoffs. Alex wanted to make them proud. He really wanted to win his first championship. Correct. The batter hit a ground ball toward second base. Here it comes, Alex told himself. This was an easy out. He crouched to field the ball, just like he'd done a thousand times before. And the ball bounced between his legs. By the time the center fielder scooped it up, the runner was safe at second. Alex looked up at his family in the stands. His best friend, J.D., patted him on the back. Relax, said J.D. Alex tried to calm down, but the harder he tried, the worse he played. I think I'm settling a record for errors and strikeouts in the same game, he told J.D. in the last inning. Good thing we're ahead. We have to win this game. Come on, Carabas, Alex shouted to the team. One more out. Pop! The batter's fly bat sailed into J.D.'s glove. Yeah, J.D., Alex yelled. We're going to the championship. But later that day, Alex couldn't help thinking about all the mistakes he made. Hey, Joe, will you throw me some pitches? Alex asked his brother. Sure, slugger, Joe said. Joe's first pitchers were high, but Alex swung at all of them anyways. Settle down, Joe said. Wait for a pitch you can hit. Alex knew Joe was right. He dug in and waited. When a good pitch came, he swang smoothly. Crack! Woo! Joe said as he watched the ball soar. That would have been a pool shot, Alex laughed. Earlier in the season, he had hit a home run into the swimming pool beyond the Caribbean ballpark. Throw me another, Alex said. The next morning, Alex got out of bed before the sun came up. His clock read 5.02, but his body was ready to play ball. He dialed JD's number. Wake up, Alex said. Let's hit a few balls before school. Are you crazy? J.D. crouched. But Alex was already out the door. Alex and J.D. hit each other. Fly balls and line drives and grounders. With every ball Alex field, he pictured himself playing a perfect championship game. His body tingled with excitement. When the school bell rang, they raced inside. Their teacher, Mrs. Gonzalez, held her nose when they ran by. If we stink now, wait till after practice this afternoon, Alex whispered to J.D. All week long, Alex and the other Carbies practiced their heart out. They ran faster, hit farther, and threw harder than ever before. Alex took extra batting practice and tried to be patient at the plate, but it was so tough. Every time he swung at an impossible pitch, he remembered the playoff games. He felt a little sick inside. What if I can't pull it together for the championship, he worried. That night, Alex finished his homework and thought about the big game. He threw a rubber ball against the wall, then caught it. Thump, catch. Thump, catch. Thump, catch. 500 times, Alex threw the ball against the wall. 500 times, he caught it. And every time he missed, he started over. At school on Monday, Mrs. Gonzalez caught Alex drawing a baseball diamond on the back of his reading assignment. In math class, he was more focused focused acing a test that he had studied hard for. It was just what he needed. When the bell rang to let school out, he felt six feet tall. Look at the ballpark, J.D. cried. Look, your family's here. Wow, said Alex. They got off work. Now we really have to win. 
but the Caribbean trailed from the start. They were still down by two in the fourth when Alex lost a fly ball in the sun and missed it. The string gray scored another run. It was four to one, and Alex's heart was pounding. In the bottom of the last inning, Alex came up to the bat. The Caribbeans were still down four to one, but the base were loaded. It was now or never. Alex swung at a pitch that was over his head. Strike! Caught the umpire. Alex watched the second pitch go by. Strike! Said the ump. Alex swung at the third pitch. He swung strong and level with everything he had. Crack! Roared the bat. Up, up, up! The ball scored. Alex dropped his bat and ran, ran, ran. And he approached second base. He heard splash, pull shot. Joe yelled from the stands. Alex Grand Slam won the Caribs their first championship. Yeah, Alex yelled as he crossed home plate. We did it. He looked up into the stands. He knew that it didn't get any better than this. Mm-hmm.